Manhattan bound 7, N and W trains will bypass the Queensborough Plaza subway station for two weeks starting later this month as the MTA will be rebuilding a section of a platform at the stop. The service changes are necessary so the MTA can carry out upgrades to make the station fully accessible, upgrades which include installing new elevators. The MTA will be demolishing and rebuilding the middle section of the entire Manhattan bound platform at the station. The new platform will be expanded by about 25% in size and it will be raised to align with trains and newly constructed platform edges. The closure of the platform is scheduled to go into effect on July 31st at 5am and will run through August 14th at 5am. During the disruptions, customers will be able to use the EM and R trains at the Queen's Plaza subway station to avoid having to backride. The upgrades are part of a $74 million project to bring the station up to current ADA standards. The project, which started in February and is scheduled to be completed in the middle of 2024, includes installing two elevators at the southern entrance of the station. The elevators will help those with disabilities to better access the station as well as customers with luggage, prams or other heavy items. The Queensborough Plaza station is a busy transfer point that served around 97,000 riders on an average weekday in May. The MTA is also upgrading the existing street and station stairs to current ADA standards while an accessible elevator is also going to be constructed on the station's north side. That elevator is being funded by the developer of a 26-storey apartment complex adjacent to the station. For more information on the project, visit queenspost.com.